Hey gamers, Guilty here, and this time we're doing Cake Cargo Chaos. This one's a tricky one to do in one playthrough, but if you're up for a challenge, it is possible, as you'll see. The pro time is 4 minutes 35, and the bonus objectives include throw all the fruit away, use the lever less than 6 times, and deliver all the bears first. We also have another character crate to collect. Right from the start, you'll want to collect the orange, cucumber, and watermelon slices and just chuck them in the middle. Throwing all the fruit away in the middle is quite time consuming and this is why it's hard to get the pro time and the bonus objective in one playthrough. In between these fruit you'll find four little biscuit lolly things. You're going to have to put four of them on the platform on the top right as you'll see here. And then once they're all fully loaded we're going to hit that lever to send them across. The character crate is over to the right and you can put it on any conveyor belt to collect it but don't do this yet because you need that bonus objective put all the gummies first so don't go for that temptation otherwise it will void this objective. As you can see it took over a minute just to get all the fruit into there and that's just from one side so as you can see it's probably really tight for time but once you get all the biscuits on send that over and do the same with the gummies there's three gummies to put onto the other platform to the right and you want to make sure you don't accidentally hit the switch because you can only do this in five hits throughout the level to get that bonus objective. I actually quite enjoyed this level, like all the bonus objectives kind of complement each other and it's more strategy to work out the best way to do it. If you want to jump on the conveyor while it's moving you have to slap that switch, don't grab it and pull it because you don't have enough time to jump on it if you do that. And once those gummies go to the left, put them straight into the conveyor belt and you'll finish your first objective, put all the gummies first. Now for the other bonus objective, we're going to get rid of all the fruit on this side too. Now you don't want to put those little cupcakes on the conveyor yet because they can easily be knocked off the edge, so wait until all the fruit are off first. Now you're already 2 minutes in the level at this point, so you don't want to accidentally hit that lever in the middle. It is possible, I've done it a few times. You don't want to void yourself before putting all the cupcakes on there. The watermelons are a bit heavy and the strategy I use to do this as quickly as possible is kind of like do a little rotation, use that momentum through the watermelon to throw it off the edge. So now you really have a choice, you can put the lollies on first or you can put the cupcakes, it really doesn't matter because they go in the same destination anyway. Once you load the gondola, hit that switch and you'll get the biscuits from the other side which you can put in the conveyor. Now be very careful at this point because these biscuits and the cupcakes, if you accidentally kick it, it can go off the edge very easily. I've done this a few times on the other side and you'll see why. By now if you've been following this guide to the T, you should hit that lever and it should be your fourth time. Jump on with the cupcakes and you're going to load the cupcakes on the conveyor and I'll show you a strategy to mitigate yourself from knocking those cupcakes in the river. You can see it was a very close call with that previous cupcake. You want to make sure you go over to the river side and pick them up because if you were to kick them they'll just go towards the right instead of where the river is. Once the cupcakes are done, you're going to send the lollies over to this side and while you're waiting, you may as well pick that character crate up and put it on the conveyor. The lollies have the same weight as a watermelon, so you can use that same technique, use the momentum to your advantage. And the pro time is 4 minutes 35, so I just scraped it in doing all the bonus objectives too. And with 4 seconds to spare we got all 5 stars and we got the style crate as well. If you found this video helpful please hit that like and subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!